votes in. You're welcome for the Pareos. Um, we're going to take a look at those evaluations, and we're going to find out what all the stories are, and um, we're going to see what is you know what is it that you want for another time, and can we can we. Okay, not we, but can we do that in a year or maybe two years? You know, what what is it that uh, what is it that we as Wahine are looking for? What is it that we want from one another? And how can we, as PEK has said, how can we continue to feed one another? Um, so it's it's mutual, so that we're all taking care of one another. So we don't know. We're going to take a look. We're going to post all the information on the website uh, and all of the other sources that are possible. And we hope that you will stay in touch with one another, with your friends you reconnected with, as I will, with new friends, and um, and really, really, eo wahine. Okay. Oh, photos. Okay. Website, photos, videos, everything that we took, go to the website. Sometimes it'll link you to another site, like the parts that were live streamed. Those will be available later. Some of you that some of you were filmed, you may not have been here live streamed, but you know what? They're still going to be on air uh, in the future. So within the next couple of days, we'll start. We'll come up with a schedule and we'll start to. Um, We'll start airing some of the videos, some of the sessions, the workshops from the last two days. So go to the website, ahawahine.org, ahawahine.org. <gasps> oh, look. You know who this is? Yeah. Tammy Smith. Yeah. Tammy Kealoha Smith. She fed us. <laughs> Tammy, can you tell us a little bit about the food we ate and where it came from? What did you guys eat? Uh, yeah. well, um, mahalo, first of all, for allowing me to be part of Ahawahine. Mahalo to you guys um, for entrusting that, um, that I can feed you guys well. Uh, I just hope that everybody can identify with the food and that helped you to realize who you are with your connection with food and um it for me just preparing and uh coming up with the menus and making sure that we have our foods that belong to us as people um makes a difference and prepared with lots of good mana and i gotta let you guys in on a secret it was prepared by orakane in my family <laughs> So, obviously, you guys didn't see them. I kept them well hidden. <laughs> Did I do a job on that? Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's very hard to hide uh, one of us. But, um, but my my husband, my brothers, my sons worked really hard to provide all the food that was given this whole uh, weekend and. Um, with kind hearts, that's for sure. Wanting to make mom proud, uh, wanting to make sure that mom stood out, wanting to make sure that Aipono lives, you know, and, and that's the difference. We want to make sure that Aipono lives in all of us, and um, with us providing it, everybody can partake of it, and everybody can learn from it also and enjoy it and know that you can cook the same way. Yeah, enjoy your food a little bit better, but um, just thank you, and you know we buy local, eat local, um, eat what belongs to us, and mahalo for enjoying the food. Thank you. Thank you so much. Aloha. So I just wanted to point out that um, I took just a teeny kuleana, and um, I am uh, kamaili po'oi to the fullest, and I usually wait to the very last minute to actually complete my task, in which I did this time as well. So, but 
what um, the, uh, these ladies have gifted me uh, the responsibility of doing is um, collectively um, pulling together um, our resources as Hawaiian women within our community that offer services, products, and, um, and, and if you're in business for yourself. So um, we've created a monkey survey, um, or survey monkey, I, I should say. So yeah, <laughs> a monkey, yeah. I am a monkey. Um, <laughs> so w what that's going to do is it's going to um, give us a lot of um, information to collect and um, eventually um, start to work and collaborate all of that information on the website, on the Ahawahine website, so that we, if you need a haircut service or if you need lomi lomi, we can actually um, have services within um, different groupings on the website that we can turn and actually um, use our sisters within our communities, um, use our sisters within um, other communities on, on the outer islands as well. So we want to encourage you to please spread the word. Um, and we want to, you know, and for it, right now, it's just very, very basic. And we'll hopefully eventually, as we build, um, be able to really start to break things down as far as categories. But please, by all means, we would love to support the ones that, um, that you know, that are all of our ohana and that have actually, you know, been here. And uh, what greater resource that is through our wonderful website. So. I encourage you to, you know, please share the word as well as um, sign up if you have any businesses or um, um, or services that you would like to um, get out there and kahe out to the community. So, yay! Mahalo, Kamaile. At this time, we'd like to ask you to stand up while we wrap up, um, wrap up the evening, wrap up the afternoon, join hands um, for Hawaii Aloha. We also ask for those that. Don't have any place to go afterwards. If you want to help to uh, kokua the cleanup, we can always use that help too. Don't be surprised if once we finish, the men come pouring down the stairs to clean up, to wrap up, because they're waiting upstairs for the word, the word.
I am so, so elated to have been given the opportunity to be here and just to be with women, all women. It's so empowering, uh, so supportive. The conference is, a, is an opportunity to bring together Hawaiian women, to bring together the women of our community, to share all of the best and the beautiful that we all have to share with one another, and to really uh, showcase the good work in our community and, um, and what folks are doing. We do have our own uh, problems and situations, and uh, as I look through the program, it seems to fit a lot of things that I'm concerned about. I learned a lot. I mean, as a Hawaiian woman, what my role is, what I should be doing, how I should be feeling. And actually, there's a lot of workshops that really helped us to get in tune with who we are. The conference has been awesome because anytime you get hundreds of Hawaiian women together to talk about everything from health to creativity to business to leadership, uh, it's, it's a manifold experience because you know we're everywhere and we do everything. A wonderful thing to have to come down here and join and meet all the young kupunas, you know, and uh, the wahines that today I didn't think that there was going to be much younger one. I wish I could see a little older ones also. <laughs> got a health screening from Keola Mamo. I talked with the Kalka about my health. I was given information about like programs for Native Hawaiians, like for weight management, um, if I needed mental health services, there are free programs available. Everybody has such great experiences and we're often so busy taking care of our ohana or in school like myself or at work that it's really a chance to sit down and talk story and learn from each other. I just love being with other Hawaiian women. You know, strengthens your mana.